Well, hello there. I'm Shannon Grissom and welcome to another episode of Painterly's Two Minute Tips. Inside, you'll find tips on painting, marketing, the creative process, and so much more. Don't miss a thing. Please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you inside. Today, we're going to talk about creating with your non-dominant hand. Have you ever tried to write with your non-dominant hand? Uh, you know, a good way to check in with your inner child is to ask yourself a question with your dominant hand and then answer with your non-dominant hand. You'll be amazed at what you unearth. Similarly, try creating a painting with your non-dominant hand. All sorts of stuff streams through your consciousness. I've been working on this one for a week and it's amazing what I've learned about myself. When you use your non-dominant hand, it stimulates both hemispheres of the brain. The left hemisphere is the cognitive side and the right hemisphere is the creative side. When both hemispheres are working together, you get powerful results, both mentally and physically. So there you go. Try creating a painting with your non-dominant hand. It's good for you on so many levels. Thanks for joining me today. For the latest tips and lessons, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll see you next time.